and gentlemen, wait, it might be morning. I don't know when this is being published. But today we're going to go through a new, uh, not really new, it actually was developed in I think like the 1880s, but a, an awesome type of concrete mix called per pervious concrete. And we'll be showing you a sample here in a second. We're going to be using some of the basic materials that you can find at Home Depot or Lowe's or your basic hardware store uh, to make pervious concrete. Now, the objective is to teach you how to make this concrete and also recognize the little innuendos to make sure that it's a good mix and uh, <laughs> define pervious concrete. Concrete is normally a very dense, solid, rock-like piece of material. If you pour water over it, the water kind of splashes and goes off to the side. Pervious concrete has just enough paste to cover the rocks and normally we use one type of rock, one size of rock, to allow pores to be created as that concrete hardens. Now what that means is that water, when you pour over it, is not going to hit and splash off the sides. The water will actually filter through the concrete. Now isn't that freaking awesome? So the mix design, just going to let you know what it is and then we'll cover it. Eight, this is pounds per cubic yard, 860 pounds per cubic yard of uh, Type 1-2 uh, ASTMC 170 Portland Cement. This stuff right here now, if you're going to handle this stuff, you want to make sure to wear gloves and you have your face mask on. Um, and then I'm also using this pea gravel, this 3 8 inch rounded rock. I wouldn't use a, um, a chip rock because it'll make flowability pretty hard, but you can. I just wouldn't do it. And there's river rock almost everywhere. Um, and, and there's some good stuff out there, and you can even get this at Home Depot. And for the size of project that we're going to do today, we really don't need that much of this stuff. Uh, and the water cementitious ratio, it's going to be a 0.45. So with uh, 1.1 uh, on the absorption, 1.01 on the moisture, our batch water is 5. Point, oh, so uh, that was pounds per cubic yard. We're going to do. Uh, about a little bit less than a half of a cubic foot, so we're using 12.7 pounds of our Portland cement, 10.5 uh, pounds for our pea gravel, and I'm going to do a moisture on this, and then 5.7 pounds on our uh, water. And that 5.7 pounds, we already did the moisture on it, so with the absorption of 1.1 and a moisture of 1.01, um, we need 5.7 pounds of water for our batch. And what you're going to get out of that is something that you know, the paste is just going to cover the rock. Um, it's going to be a little bit shiny. You'll see it here in a second. Okay, I'm going to finish it up with our plan is to weigh out and batch our three materials that we're going to be using to mix those three materials for you, place those materials sample, then we're going to analyze the sample and then wrap it up with a concise summary of everything we did to teach you how to make a new type of concrete. We'll see you here in a little bit. Um, so I made a mistake and we had to rip and strip the mix design out. You didn't see the mistake because Patchouli is one of the best editors in the world. So. Um, so change up the mix design per cubic yard. We got 707 pounds of a Type 1 2 Portland cement, uh, 2,575 pounds of a 3 8 inch pea gravel river rock. And the absorption of that was a 0.8 and the moisture it was uh, SSD. So. Um, really had no change, but it definitely changed up the weights before we had like an even. Now we have heavier on the rock, which is something that we want. When we were weighing it out, we noticed right away. And our, our water cementitious is a 0 0.30, and we're using two ounces per hundred weight of a high range water reducer. So uh, remember, we're doing this for a pervious concrete to allow water to pass through, and we're going to be using it at the post, but you're going to see right here what it looks like and how we mix it up. So let's go make some magic happen. So that was a, that was a good mix. 
Um, you know, you would notice in the video that I didn't use the traditional ASTMC 192. Uh, this is definitely not a traditional mixing method. But also, the last time I made this mix, was that seven years ago? Which, oh, Pervious. So. And, you know, the mix really depends on how much, how much binder you need on the gradation of the aggregate. And this is definitely different from the gradation that we originally used. So that's why I had to actually take out a full scoop of cement and I've got to weigh that out and uh, take it out of the next mix. But as you can see, I have this nice shiny mix here. I've got paste coating the aggregate and I think it stand, stands to be argued that could have taken out a little bit more powder. Yeah, so this is a good mix, not terrible, but the next mix we are going to do a second one. I'm going to take a little bit more of that powder out, that, that total cement, uh, because I want a little less paste, but I still want that shininess. If you come to a point where I did, where you've lost that shininess, it's gone from a shiny to a dull color, then either you need a little bit more high range or a little bit more water or it might be a combination of the two. What we just did was try to show you what pervious concrete is. It's a concrete that allows water to pass through it. It's a great place to use where there's a lot of flooding and you still need that water to get to the groundwater table or to that natural soil. Uh, it's easy to make. Basically what you're doing is using one aggregate size, three eighths, a uh, one inch or a half inch, and just enough paste to cover the aggregate and have it all stick together. So I hope you had some fun. I hope you learned something and saw some cool concrete. Uh, great to bring to bars or parties to do a little trick with and bet people. And then people think you're actually unusual for bringing concrete with you to parties. So don't do that. Actually. Anyway, hope you enjoyed. Like, subscribe. Don't forget to give us your concrete questions, comments, concerns. Go concrete. Beat asphalt. Mm -hmm.